Denver Broncos on the road to face the Raiders in Las Vegas. Raiders are four and a half point home favorites. The Broncos are 0-4 against spread in when they're in the Raiders. I was going to say in Las Vegas, but I guess it goes back to Oakland slash LA, depending on how far back you go with the Raiders. In Las Vegas, 0-5 against spread versus Las Vegas. 13-7 against spread in their last 20 overall. 12-5 straight up versus Las Vegas. So they seem to be able to beat the Raiders but not cover the spread. They're 4-10 straight up in their last 14 road games. The underdog is 4-0 against spread versus. The under is 7-0 in the head-to-head -head matchup in the last 7 games. Under is 4-1 versus in Las Vegas. 7 of the last 8 Raiders games have gone over the number though. 4-0 against spread versus AFC West is Las Vegas. 7-3 against spread their last 10. 1-5 against spread at home. Raiders have zero pass rush. They rank 31st in the league in sacks. Will Locke have time to pass? Who knows what's going on? Phillip Lindsay, another question of health here because he's such a dynamic running back. He's averaging 5.8 or 5.9 yards per carry when he's playing. The trouble is he's hardly played at all. I have him in one of my fantasy teams and fucking I've had him on the bench most of the fucking year because I can't start him. I have to pick up Melvin Gordon to piggyback him half the year. Or I got Melvin Gordon in one and Lindsay in my other. But anyways, it's a mess. I like Las Vegas to win this game, but they're not going to win by five points. I think Denver covers the spread. Look out for a sneaky upset because Denver could straight up win this game as well.